my YouTube channel. I hope you're having a wonderful day. I also hope you've been enjoying the last few vlogs. Now obviously you may have noticed a slight change, especially towards the niche of my content. Now I am through and through an equestrian content creator that is exactly where I started and that is what I love but I also do have other passions in my life as well which include skincare, fashion as in like lifestyle fashion, um, beauty as I've said etc I would really love to be able to tie them all together and show you every single side of my life especially on YouTube which I feel is the the rawest place to be on social media and it's a place that I feel very safe and comfortable and I really hope you guys can um, come along on this journey with me and, and then I really hope I can start to benefit you in some way whether it's discount codes on your favorite skincare items and things like that and really grow this side of my channel. I've actually just arrived home from a content day with none other than my best friend Sammy. We have honestly shot some amazing photos today even though it was absolutely Baltically freezing. It's the 1st of February that I'm filming this bit of video and oh it was a bitterly chilly wind today. We are vlogging for the full day tomorrow. I'm going up to ride Ringo. Um, he hasn't been ridden in about two or three days due to weather and work. So we'll spend the whole day tomorrow at the yard. Um, I have got some work to do first thing in the morning. My plan as well is to get up first thing tomorrow and head to the gym. I really want to get into a new routine of just getting up, going to the gym and just getting on with life. So that is my next plan. Here's my dog's barking in the background. There must be some, there must be somebody daring to walk past the house. <laughs> However, before I actually fully begin this video, I have to share with you an offer which is an offer which is above and beyond. I think it's maybe the offer of the century. Um, all of the details will be in the description box down below. So do head down there if you are wishing to take up the opportunity to shop this offer. Right, so it's one of my favorite skincare brands, which is Liz Earl. I'm sure you've heard of them before. If you haven't, this is a beautiful, 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 <laughs> do I say beautiful one more time, skincare brand. As I say, it is one of my favorites. Now, I have got a bag of goodies here and this bag of goodies is usually is usually over double the price of what this is individually. Now you can purchase the full contents of this now you can purchase the full contents of this bag for £54.50. And inclusive of that is a free botanical essence of choice, which is worth £59 on its own. So you are getting over a hundred percent of the value <laughs> in this bag. Now the botanical the botanical essence I've chose is the number 15 eau de parfum. This just smells absolutely heavenly. The case looks like this and let's give her a little open up. And I definitely haven't shown you the best things of all yet. So this is the perfume and this honestly, oh my goodness, it just smells beautiful. Mm, this one's very, it's very spicy, it's very woody, it's just giving a, mm, I just, I love it. Mm, this is so, it's honestly so good. Now getting on to the skincare bundles, this is where it gets fun. So inside here, you have a full size instant boost skin tonic. As we can see, it's a really, really big bottle and there's 200 mils worth of product in here. You also get my favorite product from Lizelle, again, full size, and it actually does also come with the cloth. This is the cleanse and polish. This stuff, this is, it's magic. This is how, um, if you want to kind of feel like you're having a spa at home, this is the this is the product that you need. It just feels so luxurious on the skin. And you also get a moisturizer of choice. So as I said, with the botanical essence, you get this of choice, and you also get options for your moisturizer as well. I have gone for the um, repair skin rich cream, uh, the skin repair rich cream. That's the way <laughs> that's the way the words come out. Um, and this looks like this. I take it out of its little packaging. And it's, um, I'll use it on the back of my hand for a second just to show you guys. Now, personally, I can't smell a scent there at all. So if you do have sensitive skin, I can't smell any form of scent there. But I'll pop it on the back of my hand. And as we see, this is a very rich cream. So it's going to be very, very moisturizing. Um, and that is personally what I like. I do have more dry skin to anything else. And I'm not sure if we can see a difference there, but this side of my, but this hand definitely feels a lot more hydrated than my other. So again, where it gets even more exciting, with Valentine's Day and Mother's Day approaching, obviously this is a fantastic gift to give. However, there are different ways of giving this. <laughs> Option one obviously is for yourself and to keep it all for yourself, but if you are sending it to a specific recipient, then you do have other options. Now you can give the whole gift as one together. There's also free delivery as well on all of this. So you can give it all together. So you can choose the eau de parfum, you can choose your moisturizer and have this all together as one bundle. Or <laughs> if you wanted to be um, slightly selfish when giving, <laughs> you can give all of the skincare items together 
and keep the perfume for yourself and this will be shipped separately again for free um Liz and Elle are really focusing on the cost of living crisis and trying to give back give back to their community and to their customers um, and by doing this obviously they're halving the price and also giving a free eau de parfum away with free delivery this honestly is the most fantastic gift as I say for Valentine's Day for Mother's Day, if you have any birthdays coming up over the, over the next few months, this honestly is such a beautiful treat to give somebody. It comes in beautiful packaging, the products are absolutely stunning, and if you just want to either yourself a little bit of luxury or give a little bit of luxury away, then do head to the, then do head to the description box, um, because this is just an amazing deal. So, I'm going to just package everything back up again. I hope you enjoy this video. Um, and I will see you guys hopefully first thing in the morning on my way to the gym. But we will soon find out. Hello guys, excuse the state of me, but I've just but I've just got out the shower and I thought we could do some morning skincare together. I have just used the cleanse and polish. I used this last night as well. And oh my goodness, I haven't used this in I want to say about a year and a half and I've forgotten how much I loved it. Look how steamed up the mirrors are. I've literally just had the hottest shower in the world because it's gone back really chilly again. Um it's currently February the second. Um, which means that spring hopefully isn't too far around the corner. Um, but I always start off with this, and even though I'm going to be using a different toner today, I can't not use this around my trouble zone. Um, when I use this, I no longer have a trouble zone, it's the Paula's Choice BHA. Um, so yeah, that's just going on underneath first. God, I hope this doesn't go too steamy. Anyway, next up is the Lizelle Skin Tonic. And I really like the opening on this, look. It's got like a little spout. Fantastic. It does have a slight uh, scent, it smells very spa-like, and they just say to swipe it all over your face. I'm also on a new camera today, guys. I've got um, I've now got two vlogging cameras. I've got one that's a lot more of a wider lens and one that's a lot more close. This one has like no um, help to the face, whereas the Sony ones, if you watch um, a lot of vloggers and their skin looks quite blurry, it does give you more of like a soothing effect, whereas Rose, this has nothing, so we're, com so we're completely filter free this. We also didn't make it to the gym today, if I'm surprised or not, but I have just ordered. It's going to supposed to be it's supposed to be arriving tonight, so I can then tell you what it's like tomorrow morning. Um, is I have just ordered the Lumi um, alarm clock, the one that wakes you up with the like sunrise effect, because oh, it's my boyfriend's fault. Since my boyfriend moved in. He likes to sleep with the curtains shut, so I'm not getting that morning light in. Obviously, I know it's the winter as well, and what morning light. Um, but it doesn't help. He also sets about a million alarms in the morning. He has to wake up earlier than I do, which I don't mind, because I really like waking up. But when you're waking up to 13 alarms that are constantly being pressed off, oh, it's just, it's not the one to wake up to in the morning, and I'm feeling kind of drained before I wake up. So I'm hoping that this is going to help. I'm going to ask him to shut all of his alarms off tomorrow, other than one that is like the latest he needs to get up to. Um, and I'm going to try it, and then I'll wake him up as I wake up. Um, so that is my plan. Um, I also do sleep with an eye mask on, but by the time I wake up in the morning, the eye mask isn't on, so it hopefully shouldn't affect that too much. Um, this is linked to my Amazon storefront. This is the biggest hyaluronic acid you're ever going to see, and it's the best. Um, it's from a brand called Hadalabo. I think, I want to hope I'm pronouncing that right. Um, it's a Korean skincare brand. You buy them on Amazon. They also do sell in Superdrug, I think. But it's amazing, and it's huge, and it's so cheap. But it's the most hydrating hyaluronic acid I think I've ever found. So, also, I'm going to leave this linked in the description box as well. Um, I have been looking to get my hands in the K18 hair mask for donkeys. Um, it's on Amazon and it's so much cheaper on Amazon. I think it's about £40. Yes, £40 for this tiny thing. This is supposed to be the best thing since sliced bread. I've used it once on my hair three days ago. I think I washed my hair. Um, and oh my goodness, so you actually don't use a conditioner when you use it. You just shampoo and then use this as a leave-in treatment. Um, it's been one use, I can't say too much just yet, but wow. <laughs> right, now I am a new found lover of Beauty Pie. I'm going to leave that in the description box as well. Unfortunately, it's not an ad. Um, I do have an affiliates link, which will be down below. Um, I wish I was working with them. It's going to be my goal this year to work with them, and I will. <laughs> um, but I'm just obsessed with their skincare. I haven't tried um, much of their makeup. I've tried their under eye brightening, which I'll show you in a second. Because I do, like, my travel area on my face is definitely my eye bags. Um, even the day I was born, my mum said, oh, what a shame she's got baggy eyes. I've always had baggy eyes. Um, I'm just kind of scared they're going to get worse with age. So I've recently started using a retinol eye cream again from Beauty Pie, not during the day, um, just at night time. Um, 
but yeah what am i talking about oh yeah beauty pie oh i'm just i'm obsessed i'm obsessed i'm obsessed right what else do i want to use today i might actually use a little vitamin c but i can't see what i've done with my vitamin c i'm just um completely obsessed with beauty pie for a second um, if you want me to leave my favourites, I can. The Youth Bomb, mm, Japan Fusion, I need to get a new one. I've just literally run out of that. Um, I'm currently, I'm also currently slathered in the body moisturiser, the Candle Smelling Stone. Oh, I'm just, I'm a convert. I'm an absolute convert. The Lush Serum. This stuff here, I'm hoping you can see that there. Mm, is that better there? Um, it's called Lash Fuel. The stuff I quickly running through your beauty pack actually is. Um, it's basically, it's essentially giving you the best skincare money can buy without the middleman price markup. So if you're a member, which isn't, it's kind of annoying, but you do get benefits for it. You've got to be a member and it's a subscription service of £10 a month or 59 or £50 a year, I think it is. Um, I did the £10 a month and instantly regretted it when my first order came in because I was like, I love this. So next year I'm going to do the um, £59. Um, and you get, I think, like 80% of all the products. So, for example, so this is the Ceramide Eye Serum before you put a cream on. Um, and it's got, um, I'll show you, it's got like a roller ball thing, so it's really nice and cooling for your eyes. Um, so, right, okay, for example, the Lash Fuel, I think, is supposed to be something like £80 usually, and it comes down to about 15 mis I might be wrong with the 15, but it's it's no more than 20 pounds moisturizer. I really want to be putting this right on. I really want to be putting this on right now, which is the Japan Fusion, but um, I'm kind of out of it. It won't pick up anymore. I might be able to smooch a little bit on the hand. Moisturizer. And then I think we'll try the little moisturizer today before um, attempting my SPF. Very excited. And as I say, this has no scent. Well, not one that I can smell anyway. Which again, it's just wonderful it feels very thick very luxurious there are as i say different options if you don't like a thicker cream um there's like a light option i think there's sensitive options um do go to the description box and have a browse oh it does feel lovely yeah it feels automatically like it feels automatically very hydrating um as i said this isn't an ad necessarily is it an ad i haven't been paid to do this if that makes sense my link is a fill is an affiliates link um and I'm obviously working with them on my Instagram stories, um, but I just thought I'd share this with my YouTube followers as well because it's um, a pretty cool deal. So that is the moisturiser on. Very glowy, very fresh right now. Let me show you this first before my camera does die. This is the Beauty Pie Under Eye Corrector. I want to show you guys before I go. I do have to SPF, but I don't think I'm going to have time. <laughs> My camera is like, nope, I'm out now. Um, can you see the difference? This is just like the lightest. Um, it's not even a concealer. It's lighter than concealer. It has a slight pinky tone, so it's really going to brighten the eyes underneath. I think my camera is on the off. Um, but before I go, <laughs> I'm just going to be using the Elsa MD um, Factor 40, I think this is, for my SPF today. Oh, and also before I completely go as well, um, I'm still, my discount code is still available for the Spotlight Oral Care, um, Spotlight Oral Care teeth whitening stuff. They're amazing. This again is not an ad, it was an ad a couple of videos ago. Um, but if you missed that video and have wanted to try new toothpaste, new toothbrushes, teeth whitening strips that don't make your teeth go sensitive and really, really work, um, I will continue to leave the, it, I'll continue to leave my um, discount code in the description box down below. My camera is off. I will see you guys very, very shortly. I'm going to start doing some work and some admin and I will see you guys soon. Well, I'm having a very, very blonde moment. Um, I don't really know why I need to be looking when I'm filming on my phone, um, but I've basically forgotten all of my camera equipment. So the next part of the vlog is gonna be filmed on my phone, um, of which the camera quality really isn't that great. Um, here at the yard, um, I'm very, very warm and cozy. I've got multiple, multiple layers on. A Maya Dolores base layer, a Maya Dolores um, very thin hoodie, the Lemire fleece from last year, and my Aztec coat. I'm warm, I'm cozy, I'm toasty, let's go ride. 
Okay, so I'm on my way to go and get Ringo from the field. And maybe you can hear me because there is a little tiny bit of a wind today. Nothing too horrific though. It's currently 11 degrees. Now it doesn't feel like it's 11 degrees, hence why I have <laughs> so many layers on. Um, but it is starting to slowly warm up and I'm just, I'm just praying guys for some more, um, for some more hopes of spring as I'm sure we all are. Um, also, I've just gone into the lorry um, and checked since putting the dehumidifiers in there, the ones from Amazon, um, which I have linked to my Amazon if anybody is wanting to try them. So I've actually just bought them for my, because um, I've actually just bought them for my house as well, because there are like certain corners in my house that can get quite damp, even, even though I do have the heating on. Um, they're amazing, absolutely amazing. I've just gone in there. There is no damp in my lorry. It doesn't feel even slightly condensation-y. Um, and I'm hoping this weekend it's going to be warm enough just about to um, silicon at least some of the lorry um, and get it back to normal and whatever. I think we're going to do a bit of a lorry TLC job this weekend. I'm hoping, so long as it doesn't decide to um, tip it down, which the forecast so far is not saying that it's going to happen. So yeah, just on a long walk down to Ringo, as we can see as well, just talking about the weather as always, because I am British and it is British people problems. <laughs> it's a very grey day. There's no sunshine, um, but it's better than rain and it's better than minus one and I'm not complaining. Um, it's oh, just need just need some spring just need something that's gonna be like warm sunshine weather i need it i'm in my area boots maybe the geotech ones or something like that um they are absolutely amazing um i literally wear them all the time they've never given me any blisters even from day dot um holland cooper thermal leggings as well because of the warmth and i think i've already said about my aztec coat but this literally is the best coat on the planet it is not the most aesthetically pleasing or pretty one but oh my god it's warm and then in the distance let me zoom in you can see the dingo bear <laughs> So I'm going to give him a good groom um, and re-tidy up his mane, pressing it over on the, on the right way. Oh my goodness! I might be too late. Hang on. There's like a million deer in this field. Let me see if I can, if they start to get, they just like galloped up. I can see a white bottom. I don't know if you guys can see that white bottom. I don't know if it's going to make me that's going to move though. Oh dear. Oh dear, quite literally. Rug. Hi! Hi there! You're so handsome. You really are the most handsomest boy in the world. Okie dokie, baby. Do you want to hold your rope then? Have you got it? He loves to hold himself and lead himself in. Come on then. <laughs> oh, did you drop it? Do you want it again? No? Oh, you do, don't you? Go on then. Have you got it? You have. <laughs> That's a nice way of having it. Come on. Oh, big shapes. Come on then. Hi, you have a kiss. <laughs> so yeah, that is today's little plan. Um, we've got lots of horses to walk past actually, so I'll keep the video on because it's quite fun listening to him chat away, isn't it? It always makes me laugh anyway. <laughs> he always keeps me entertained. Don't pick you on as we come out the gate. Oh, darling. Come on then. Oh, wow. This way, come on. <laughs> come on. Yes. Angel. Blood, blood, blood. <laughs> He's so cute. Come on. Let's look at the new horse. <laughs> You're not going to speak. Well, there's me leaving the video on because I thought you were going to be a chatterbox today. Them, so I will see you back in the yard.
live secrets underground oh. Your hand on my chest My heart beats for you I keep my arms out and hold you like before We can fly school properly. Well, probably about three times since Christmas. Um, he's raring to go today. His, his girlfriend's off on a hack and he's like mega jealous. Um, I've just got it on top of there just in case I need it for um, flexion reasons because if he hasn't been schooled for a while he does get quite heavy and then it's really difficult to, to bend and flex and kind of get him in an outline. Um, which I like to do without force if I want to keep it nice and happy so a bungee is like a really nice training aid in my opinion, in my opinion because it's um, just elastic and you know if he gives it gives but it doesn't not give if he doesn't give either do you know what I mean like it's just like a what's the word like a nice little nudge to be like be nice in the hand today um, yeah we're gonna get on we're in the um, espresso set today um, it's looking beautiful as always um, since recording that I missed my ring doorbell and I've got a parcel that's been not delivered which is always so annoying and I also don't know what that parcel is which is even more annoying because I also it's not like I think oh I've got to go and pick this up I'm now thinking well, what is it <laughs> um, but yeah I'll see you once I'm on board <laughs> here we are gorgeous gorgeous boy <laughs> yeah, it's just a very dull and dark day today it's not really the one, but at least it's not raining. And at least it's not freezing cold. It's <laughs> a good boy. Well, guys, um, oh, I've got a little sticky out here. Hang on. <laughs> Let's put her back in. Oh, she's still out. This hat always pushes my ears down. Um, we've just finished. Oh my God, I'm so hot. Ringo's hot as well. He was a gem. You can see how I'm like, how red my chest is. <laughs> Um, that was amazing. That was the best schooling session we've had since, well, since last year. Um, 
and I just I now feel like it's onwards and upwards so long as we continue to have nicest weather at least like two three times a week um, give me two weeks of this today um, and I'm gonna start going out for lessons and things again um, I feel like my lorry might need to service hang on did you all see that <laughs> um, yeah, I think that is good. It's like one thing after the other with my lorry. Um, we think the tyre is fine. We've put some air in it um, and we're just going to see what it's like at the weekend because I wouldn't have a clue what I was looking at. But Jack's got all like the measurements or something or other for how much air's in it to see if it goes down anymore. Um, so if not, I need a new tyre, but that I don't think is the biggest job. But then again, I have no idea what I'm on about. Um, and then it's out of oil, so I've just ordered some oil. Um, and then we're going to have a look at when it was last serviced because it hasn't been serviced since I've had it. And when did I get it? About August, September? Um, so yeah that is the, the thing and then yeah back out for some lessons so lots of different places i really want to start getting them out before the end of feb realistically um because then it's kind of hitting before spring hits and hopefully it'll just desensitize him a little bit um and yeah that is my plan so i'm gonna get off now head back home as i said i've missed the postman but i think he's been again i've had like a, a day of or two yesterday i was like a day of ordering things <laughs> that i don't need well i kind of do need like they're things in my garden i feel like i'm gonna be a bit of a green fingers this spring um or at least try to be um so yeah that is like my little update he's a very very good boy i love him lots and lots and lots and um we just chilling. <laughs> good morning guys. So I have done it this morning. I have woken up I'm all in my gym gear and I'm ready to go. It's 7 a.m. Um, the Illumi lamp arrived late last night I didn't show you it actually. Um, I have never woken up so peacefully and so Kind of like feeling like so naturally in all my life so early in the morning at least especially um, So I'm feeling really good. So I'm gonna continue to log how I feel with it over time with you um, I will leave it linked in the in the description box if you would um I'll leave it linked in case you have or, like ever considered getting one before, um, or if you um, or if you just trust my um, first use kind of thoughts on it. But it was amazing, and I, I'll show you it actually really quickly here now because I actually oh, it's gone very dark. Um, oh, sorry, it's gone very dark. But I actually um, went to sleep really peacefully with it as well on the sunset mode. Is it here? Um, so it looks really really nice and smart as well on a bedside table. Um, and this is all the different glow options you have. So it goes all the way up. Um, to a really really bright one so that's how I woke up with it like this but over the last 30 minutes of me waking up it had all these different light sections which I think is really very cool so I'll leave it linked down below um, but I personally have never woken up so nicely in my life so I'm now to the gym um, also guys this is Jack's in the background um, drying his hair but um, yeah I'll leave this link down below as well because I just feel like it looks a lot jazzier and smarter on my wrist I wanna wake up in the morning Someone new I wanna do the things they say we shouldn't do I wanna wake up in the morning With someone new Their love I get to be And break the rules I wanna wake up in the morning Tablespoons of the protein powder, so I think that works out at about 100 calories actually. Now that I had, um, there is the Jessica Health JS Health collagen scoop powder, apple juice. I think that's it. I think. I actually think it looks very, very delicious. Oh, guys, I've just got piano music on in the background, which I'm probably not going to be able to talk for very long because I'll get copyright, but how cute are these little babies? My little babies. You're in mummy's office, are you? Hello, guys. <laughs> I feel like... Is this focused? I hope it's focused. Um, I feel like we have done quite a lot on this video today. This is going to be the last day on this video. I was kind of thinking, do I film today or do I do, like, a separate video? Um, but we're going to continue this vlog. I'm also thinking about cutting my video times down slightly so let me know what you think about that i know lots of people do like the really long videos but if you'd prefer like 20 to 30 minutes as opposed to like full hour vlogs um and do ooh, that was a bump 
<laughs> then do let me know. Um, I've got Jack here again, and everybody keeps asking for his YouTube channel. So what I will do is I'll leave it linked in the description box of today's video. Um, or if you type it in, it's JCL Automotive, and it's all on cars. So um, if you like cars or have a brother, family member, friend, sister, mother, brother, whoever and wherever that is into cars and like reviews of cars, um, then definitely head to Jack's channel. Uh, this morning we are off. I said this morning. It's not this morning anymore. It's now one o'clock. We are on our way to the yard. We just done some. Just done some photos for Holland Cooper in this country outfit um, and I've got an equestrian outfit to shoot um, with them as well which I think you guys are going to really like actually um, it's a very um, like basic outfit not basic in terms of it's basic but it's a very I kind of like wear it every day non-trendy always in trend type outfit if that makes sense um, so we're doing that I'm going to be riding Ringo which hopefully Jack will be very kind and film some of me riding Ringo for today's video go on then <laughs> what I'll do though is I'll give him um, my phone to take some photos to take some videos on my phone instead of um, my camera because it'll be a bit warmer for his hands um, we're sorting the lorry out slightly today um, it needs oil so we're doing that we're going to check the tyre pressure as well um, and get things like that sorted I'm just planning the next few weeks worth of videos which are hopefully going to be some exciting ones I feel like the last few weeks have been maybe slightly on the boring side um, just due to weather and illness and getting life back together after the new year um, so hopefully now the weather's starting to perk up slightly there'll be some more exciting content coming and I have something else to share with you guys this morning and I can't remember but on that note, instead, I will see you guys at the end. I'm back 10 minutes later because I remember what I wanted to tell because I remember what I wanted to tell you guys. Um, after this yard, we're off to my mum's yard to check on Darcy and Holly. Um, so that's going to be in this part of this video as well. So do keep watching. Okay, guys. Oil. Oil man is his new name. Well, I really need to clean. Look how filthy it is from when I took it to the mechanics that is on a farm, basically. <laughs> she needs. A, she definitely needs a wash. We're also putting some odour spray in her, make her smell nice. Goldilocks. Goldilocks really needs some TLC. After a winter of um, not being, well, not being not loved, but not being driven. I was also told by Jack the other day that I needed oil, so I have oil. Because apparently if you don't have oil in a vehicle, it blows up, so... Um, That's definitely not what I said. <laughs> what did you say? <laughs> <laughs> what does it, it do then? It stopped working. Oh, okay. <laughs> Same difference to me, to be fair. Um, so yeah, we're putting this in today as well. Oh, this boyfriend life is great. I don't have to think about anything. <laughs> I'm so useless when it comes to vehicles. Oh, that's quite a lot of dust in there. Is that dust? What is that, Jack? That cloth. What's that? It's just the lining. Oh. <laughs> it's fine. Okay. Apparently it's fine. Ooh, because I'm on a new camera, the zoom's very slow. Oh, there is oil in it. It's overfilled. Oh. But it's saying the oil light's on and when I turn it on. Yeah. So it doesn't need a service. Yeah, but it might be saying it because it's overfilled. Right. Well, I mean, it's meant to be between them two things. Oh, sh sugar, okay. Yeah, it's like way more than that. So it's not going to blow up. <laughs> wow. bad. Oh really? Yeah. How do you sort that then? Just keep taking it out? Uh, yeah, you need to drain it. How do you do that? Uh, you need to like go underneath the engine, take a, a screw out, like a bung. Oh. That's not going to be done today then. Uh, <laughs> I'm just in the um, the back of my lorry, getting a new outfit on. Um, we are leaving the engine running because, according to Jack, the engine doesn't sound healthy. Um, so I need to take it for a service before I take it anywhere. But I think we're just going to leave it running for like an hour because I think the fact that it never gets run that much um, because obviously it hasn't had, had an MOT on it. So um, and I didn't realise it didn't have an MOT on all these different things that have all happened over the last couple of months. Um, yeah, it needs using basically. So we're going to be leaving it running for a little while and hoping that it sounds healthier. Um, and then we will um, resume our day. <laughs> well, yeah, so I've got this lovely, let me undo the door so you can actually see the colour. This lovely, oh, no, that's very bright, hang on, wait for it to sort itself out. Um, this lovely navy base layer on with the thermal breech it, with these lovely navy thermal um, leggings on. And then I've also got this really lovely hoodie to go on as well. Hello. 
again just like magic the hoodie is now on this is lovely i'm actually obsessed with this hang on and then i'm having to keep pushing the door open so you can see with the light i need to get a thing attached on that um and they've also sent they've also sent me the holland cooper gloves which i actually haven't tried before so i'm really excited to door keep shutting and now we're back in dark and now we're back in darkness so i'm really excited to try um they have the phone um finger attachment on there as well which i think is really cool and it's a nice design of a glove um so yeah i'm now already i think we're gonna go and try and take some photos of truly actually um jack's gone to sort something out with coolant whatever coolant is in the lorry there's all these things wrong with it that i haven't got a clue about it's very good that i've got a boy that um enjoys cars and stuff like that because otherwise i'd have no idea what was going on um i just kind of get in turn the car on or the lorry on and um off i go so it's um probably a lot safer for all of us um here <laughs> to have a jack around um and yeah <laughs> it's always a great day when truly's in the stable <laughs> No, that's just dirt. That's just dirt. Hi! Are you a bit grubby? Hey! Bobby girl, there's another friend of yours. She says, all my friends. Where's all my friends going? Oh. oh scary. Everything's so scary. <laughs> well, she's thirsty. She says, I have a drink first. Bartha, <laughs> she's fine. Bartha, she'll be fine. <laughs> you, you, Bartha. You, Bartha. <laughs> I think I'm all right, you know. Hey, little princess. That's so pretty. Nice slobbery, thanks. Oh, little slobbery kisses. <laughs> Blowing bubbles. Oh, <laughs> she actually is. She's so cute. Oh, my little princess. What's going on here? Look at, Look at all this dirt. Hey, look at all this mud. Seen it yet, have you, Jack, in the summer? No. She's beautiful, golden, not like this. <laughs> oh, God, you're dusty and everything. <laughs> so, when she rubs her nose on you, it's because she's enjoying it. God, it's dirty. That is dirt. That is on the dirty bottom. Okay. <laughs> she enjoying it? It's so fluffy. <coughs> God, dust. That's like months worth of dirt. Oh, I've got these little bite marks, truly. Why are you fighting? some beautify oil to try and get through this mane. I'm going to do it in sections. <laughs> it hasn't been touched in months. And as always, my discount code is in the description box anyway. Um, there we go. Look at this. This is literally mane that has not been touched since about, I don't know, October probably. I don't even remember the last time I brushed it properly. Can you see how literally that is just glistening? With three pumps, I know it's in a smaller section, but this is hair that's not been touched in a very, very long time. To now be glistening, fingers running through. Oh my goodness, this stuff. If you want to try one product first to fall in love with Naked Horse, <laughs> this is my favourite ever. I'm also going to get some collagen and kelp cream on her little cups in a minute. Hold on, Dingo's coming. Dingo's coming? <laughs> I can't see anything at the moment. 
two pumps through the rest of it just detangles it within two brushes per section like one and a half you're through one and a half three it's insane this stuff absolutely insane see darcy and everything today it's a whole horsey day i'm gonna put some more through just for condition now because what naked horse is very good at is um not just aesthetic from the outside, but it's um, amazing from like within. It really helps with the condition of the mane from within, so I like to get it into the roots and really work it in. I don't know if I've got any collagen and cup cream with me anymore. And next, we have, as we see, a very well used collagen and cup cream, but, ring, uh, but with Truly, she um, <laughs> continuously bashes herself. So, she's got a little that one's going back actually since I've last seen you, but she's got a bit of a, I don't know whether you guys can see that down there, um, but what this will do is it will help to grow all of the hair back and it will help to not grow the hair back white, especially on legs and things like that. It's amazing for cups and knocks and whatever. And I just tend to drown it once and then over the next couple of days the hair's starting to grow back and it's all growing back nice and healthily. Have we got any other knocks and bruises that one's seeming to grow back itself? Any others baby while I'm here? Just that one. Ouchie! Why don't you stand up to all your friends, hey? Why don't you stand up, stand up to everybody? Okay, let's do a full up. Let's get... Let's try one pump through here. Mix it in, get it all warm. I need to do a good brush of this face. <laughs> Look at this. Ooh, hello. <laughs> this is disgusting. Give that one. One stride. One stride in a minute. It's just got all of my eyes. It has. Oh, baby. Come here. Oh, little princess Bodhi. Oh, my little baby. Look at all this mud and things. A nice, nice witch. I don't need this bit. Something nosy. Get out of your bag. Yeah, guys, that was one pump. <clears throat> I've got so much dirt it's in my eyes and my face and my mouth. Close your eye. Okay, so back in the car, we've just got takeaway coffees from next door, and mm -mm -mm, we have cake. So I'm not sure whose is who, but we have, let me show you guys. I'm so hungry, we've been that so good just recently, but oh my god, when hunger hits, hunger hits. So Jack, you have got one Jammy Dodger Blondie. That looks unreal. Thank you. Thank okay, you, my darling, it's quite all right. And I have what I think trumps what Jack has. <laughs> and, mm, 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 mm. Kinder Bueno, Kinder Bueno, <laughs> Kinder Bueno brownie. Look at that. Mm, mm, mm. And now to Darcy and Holly. Holly, hi, baby. It's dark now. We're here, Holly. Hi, Bubby. Oh, it's a bit bright. Oh, oh. Hi. Hi, little princess. Oh, what's happened to your tooth? You got new 
a tooth coming through or something? You saw teeth, baby teeth. Oh, what's happened to the tooths? Oh, you're so cute, little Holly Dotty. You're so cute. <laughs> Right, I don't know whether to bring Darcy in with that noise on or not. I might just check a rug in the field. Okay guys, we probably look horrific right now with the flash on on my phone. Um, but as we can see, it's very dark now. Um, there's noises up the top, mechanical work going on. So I feel like in the pitch black, it's probably not the best idea to bring a wash cob in. Um, but I do just want to check her rug, so we will go and find Darcy. Um, um, oh, she's here! <laughs> wow! Oh, she's so bright! Hi, baby! Hi! Oh, hi, should we check your little rug? Princess? She, you know, ask Jack to hold that for me. Hold the bag, it's perfect. Ooh. It's very in the cold, everything hurts so much more. Like, even opening a gate hurts. <laughs> oh, there's a spider. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Girl. Okay guys, I am finishing this video here. I hope you've all enjoyed it. Yeah, Holly! I hope you've all enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new. And um, click the like button if you did enjoy this video.